What is garbage collection? In Java, each thread starting with the main method thread has stack space where all the local primitive types are stored and the heap space where the objects are allocated the memory. All the references will point to these memory locations on the heap. The process by which the Java virtual machine automatically clears the memory allocated to a particular object is called garbage collection. The garbage collector is a daemon thread that runs within the JVM in the background and garbage collects the objects when they are unreachable. Let's see what unreachable means by looking at an example of an account. We have an account class and two instances of this account class X and Y. So the memory is allocated on the heap and this X and Y point to that memory locations. Now if we say X is equal to new account again, the object one here will become unreachable because X will now point to a new memory location on the heap. Y still points to object two. So the object one is unreachable and the garbage collector thread, if it runs at this point, it can garbage collect this. Now, if we say Y is equal to X, both one and two are unreachable. And now if the garbage collector runs, it can clear up both these objects. Finally, if we say X is equal to null and Y is equal to null, all the objects on the heap are unreachable. And if the garbage collector hasn't run yet, and if it runs now, it can garbage collect all these three objects. It's up to the JVM when the garbage collector will run and clean, clean up the objects. Although they are not, although they are unreachable, they might not be cleared right away. Whenever the garbage collector runs, it will clear them up. Two things to remember, we cannot force the garbage collector to run, but we can always request and recommend and request the JVM to run the garbage collection by calling system.gc method. To summarize, garbage collection is a process by which a daemon thread, the garbage collector thread will clear up the unreachable objects on the heap.